Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am not here with Geeky Sparkles, but we're going to talk about EA. Uh, EA reportedly tried to sell itself to Apple. Uh, lots of reports about this one. This is uh, Apple reportedly talked with Electronic Arts about potential acquisition. EA looking for a buyer, um, which I kind of missed. This, this broke over the weekend. And this shouldn't surprise anyone. Honestly, all these video game companies are looking to be bought out. You know, they're all they're all getting bought out. Everybody's gobbling up these companies. And uh, EA, um, you know, is is kind of troubled <laughs> right now. But they said that uh, they're looking for uh, somebody to buy them out, whether it's Amazon, Apple, Disney or NBC Universal. Uh, you know, I don't think Disney has has any money right now to buy anything. But uh, I could be wrong. I mean, they've they've kicked all their games over to EA or a lot of their games over to EA. In fact, they. Uh, shut down development on their own in-house titles uh, very quickly. Disney Infinity, they shut it down so they could kick all their stuff to Electronic Arts. And then we saw what happened with the Star Wars games and the microtransactions and, and all of that that jazz. So let's, uh, let's talk about this. See who could be buying EA. Before we get into it any further, please subscribe. For more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys, over 268,000 subs. Thank you for the support. We do talk about video games, not as much as we used to, but uh, there's been a lot of drama going on in the video game industry. Like every one of these major, you know, triple A studios is trying to sell itself off. We got Blizzard selling itself off to uh, Microsoft. Uh, we've got Bungie selling itself off to Sony. There's there's talk that Square is going to sell itself off to Sony. Um, and they sold off uh, all their Western game studios. You know, it's it's a mess. It's it's Highlander, right? Um, and it's weird because most of the games I play are indie titles or retro games. I, I don't play a lot of the AAA titles because they bore the hell out of me. But um, anyway, a couple of days ago, this broke. Uh, EA is reportedly pursuing acquisition and merger options with a number of potential suitors. Uh, Apple would be a good choice because, you know, again, microtransactions, right? Uh, companies approached a rumor to include Amazon, Apple, Disney, and NBC Universal. We're going to talk more about uh, Apple. Um, again, this is coming from Eurogamer. Okay. Uh, Electronic Arts is reportedly pursuing acquisition and merger opportunities with a number of different potential suitors. Uh, that's according to Puck, which yesterday revealed that EA has been persistent in pursuing a sale with a number of companies, including Amazon, Apple, Disney, and NBC Universal, emboldened in the wake of the Microsoft Activision deal. Well, that was kind of desperation, wasn't it? Um, in recent years, as media companies have taken greater interest in the rapidly growing gaming industry, CEO uh, Andrew Wilson and Electronic Arts have held talks with a number of different potential suitors, including Disney, Apple, and Amazon. Sources with knowledge of those talks told me, said Puck reporter Dylan Byers. Uh, several sources familiar with these talks say EA has been persistent in pursuing a sale and has only grown more emboldened in the wake of the Activision Microsoft deal. Others say EA is primarily interested in the merger arrangement that would allow Wilson to remain as CEO of the combined company. Good luck with that. It's unclear if a deal is currently in negotiation, but the reporter hinted that a deal with NBC Universal had progressed the furthest before breaking down last month after parties were unable to agree upon structure or price. We don't comment on rumors or speculation. Um, regarding M&A, EA spokesperson John Reesberg told media in a statement, uh, according to Kotaku, we're proud to be operating from a position of strength and growth, a portfolio of amazing games built around powerful, powerful loot boxes, no, <laughs> IP made by incredibly talented teams, overworked teams, and a network of more than half a billion players. News comes after the report that up to 100 people may lose their jobs as EA cuts customer support staff. Uh, in Austin and in uh, Europe, uh, EA has confirmed the layoffs and said the job losses would ultimately reduce complexity and increase our efficiency, flexibility, and scalability. Uh, yeah, so Apple reportedly had talks with them. It actually came from Mac rumors. Uh, EA tried to sell itself off to Apple, according to Apple Insider. Man, they got a lot of Apple sites out there these days. You know, Apple would probably make sense because they're kind of failing with the uh, the Apple games. You know, they don't really have anything uh, unique. And it seems like all these platforms, all these streaming platforms, 
Um, you know, they all want to have their own uh, kind of in-house AAA, you know, game developer. Um, you know, and we know that uh, Apple is microtransaction happy, so it probably would be a good fit. A lot of people said Disney. I don't think Disney's got the money. In fact, there was a rumor going around that Disney was interested in potentially buying Netflix. It's like, have you looked at Disney stock lately? They don't have the money. You know, Disney, I, I mean, I would be very surprised. I'm not say, saying it, it it couldn't happen, but I would be very surprised if Disney could scrape together the money to buy anything like EA and certainly not Netflix. Um, I'm not saying it can't happen again, but uh, very, very unlikely. They're still paying off Fox and Fox was like the most worthless acquisition. You know, I mean, they paid $70 billion for Fox. I can't imagine what they'd pay for Netflix. Uh, it'd be through the roof. I mean, I don't even know who could buy Netflix at this point, except maybe Apple. Maybe Apple will buy Netflix and EA. Um, you know, funny thing about this, though, is that, uh, you know, going back to, to Apple, that if Apple and Disney had a different trajectory, if Steve Jobs... Um, still around, they could have actually merged at some point. That people will talk about Apple buying Disney, Diz Apple, and uh, you know Disney. You know when it comes to EA too. You know they uh, um, definitely kind of screwed up there. They shut down their own uh, game development studios for Electronic Arts. You know a couple of years ago, you can read the stories. Uh, there are many of them out there talking about how Disney said was never good at developing its own in-house games, but they're very happy with uh, EA. And you know again, they said that they're talking more about Universal. I could see Universal buying EA just to stick it to Disney because uh, you know EA's doing the Star Wars games. I, I could totally see them doing that. Just be like, yeah, we're not doing Star Wars games anymore. Tough shit, Disney. Uh, tough shit. We're your competitor. And we're going to do, you know, I don't know, Shrek games or some shit, you know, you know from here on out. But um, uh, it's a pretty interesting uh, uh, thing coming up. I'm not surprised uh, at all. I, I think we're going to have Video Game Highlander. I think we're going to have like, you know, two or three companies that basically make all the major titles. Well, kind of like we do now. But I guess on some level, I'm kind of happy if, if a company like EA gets sold, if they get sold to an Apple and not like a... Hollywood studio or something, you know, even though Apple's doing movies, but, um, I don't know, just a rumor, uh, kind of missed it over the weekend, thought we'd mention it given that we've been talking about all the other, other, all the other acquisitions uh, going on. Everything's for sale. Everybody's for sale. You know, <laughs> so I'm going to wrap it up. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. We'll talk later. Now he's just tasty, delicious, rotten flesh meat, which I can consume. Don't read into it too much. Just like our museum, the cafe, it's open to Brewster is eager to serve. I don't think this was in the show. So run, 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 run. Oh, you got splatted. No. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh she was begging and what? you kicked her in the face. I don't care. Hey, guys, Squid King here, and today we're in a... <laughs> Not girl boss, not girl boss at all. She is not a material girl. She is not. Oh, it's Christmas time here in your mom. Nobody wants to join your mom. What? Like I can't even cook kid cuisine right. I would last about two minutes with Gordon Ramsay. What? Where is he? He's hiding. He's hiding from you. He better. Oh my God, you got the ax. Walker, does this look like Steven Universe? Let me punch him. Well, I'm just here for the wax. Get in the dirt. Well, that was a combination of events I probably shouldn't have put together. Anyways, let's open this bottle too. Chica Pinata. Is that official? Oh, no. There's a bootleg. Hello. Ooh, I'm sorry. Hey guys, it's Diamond Tool. Let's make a farm. Like and subscribe and buy my merch. I mean, while you're here, you guys should like really like and subscribe and buy our merch, all of which we have. <laughs> that is true. Can't run him carrying trash. And you can get away with one F bomb per PG 13 movie. Oh, I wish I'd yeah. known that sooner. Yeah. All right, so we're going to wrap this effort up. Yes. <laughs>